हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल आई एम निशांत एंड यू आर वॉचिंग टेक्स ऑल सो गाइज इफ यू आर प्लानिंग टू इंस्टॉल मैक वाइज हाई सी अराउंड योर वर्चुअल मशीन लाइक बी एम बेयर देन दिस इज द राइट वीडियो फॉर यू एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट हाउ टू इंस्टॉल मैक वाइज हाई सी अराउंड योर बी एम बेयर सो वाइज दिस वीडियो टिल एंड एंड यू विल बी एबल टू इंस्टॉल मैक वाइज सो गाइज इफ यू नॉट सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल येट दैन प्लीज मेक यू डू सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड यू कैन डू सो बाई क्लिकिंग द रेड सब्सक्राइब बटन राइट बिलो दिस वीडियो एंड दैट वे यू विल गेट द इमीडिएट अपडेट फ्रॉम माई न्यू वीडियो दैट आई एम गोइंग टू पोस्टिंग अड So let's get started and dive into our today's video. So guys, in order to move forward in this video, first of all you have to enable virtualization from your BIOS setting. I have already uploaded a video on this so you can check out the link in my description below or you can check out on the card above. Then you have to download and install WinGIF file so that you can extract the zip files. And again now you have to download and install VMware player and its patch files so that we can run operating system on this player on virtual machine and uh, at last you have to download mac os high sierra us file which we will run on vmware player so all the links are given below in the description you can check it out here you can see i have already downloaded win rar vmware player patch tool and mac os high sierra ms files all the links you can see here are given in the description below you can go up down below in the description and download it one by one so here is win rar link let's click on it first of all you have to check whether you have to install 64 bit or 32 bit uh, file so you can see my machine is running a 64 bit machine so i am going to download 64 bit as i have already downloaded it so i am not going to download it you have to download it you can also download a uh, 7zip uh, software which is uh, alternate software of winrar so download it as per your choice and then move forward now we have to download vmware player uh, you can check out the link in description and click on it you will find two major versions 12.0 and 14.0 or uh, 14.0 is the latest one you can also um, go to that side by uh, going to vmware site and click on downloads and then workstation player in free product downloads so you, here you will also see the same web page you can um, install any of these two as i have uh, downloaded 12.0 version you can also download 14.0 so here you can see my version is 12.5.8 which is mm, the version 12.0 version as i have already downloaded i am not going to download it so you can download it now let's install vmware player so double click on that and uh, install and here installation is done so let's finish now open vmware player and uh, let's check whether we have option to install mac os or not here you can see there is no option of installing mac os so first of all we have to patch vmware workstation player so that there will be a option of mac os installation so you have to download the patch file the link is down below in the description download this download at zip and uh, you will download patch file as i have already downloaded it so i am not going to download it so first of all download it first so download it first and then you will have a zip file of patch tool so extract it so i am going to extract here as it's on desktop you can extract it anywhere and now open patch tool and here you will see a patch tool now extract it also and now you will see 
two unlocker files 208 and 210 so first one 208 is for 12.0 version vmware player and unlocker 210 is for 14.0 version so i am going to extract 208 which is for 12.0 since i have downloaded vmware 12.0 so now run win dash install file as administrator and then some process will happen and your vmware player will be passed so now my vmware player has passed and now let's download the image file of mac os high sierra so here is the link here you can see there are two links first link is for one full high sierra final image which is uh, 5.8 gb and uh, second one is same image file which is in several parts six parts of 1 gb so i prefer installing in six parts because if anything goes wrong then not the whole file will be lost but uh, only a single file will be lost and after downloading six part you have to click on extract and uh, extract to a single folder and you will see after extracting the last one mac os high sierra a single folder will be there and then extract here and you will find a folder where you will find the image file of vmware mac os high sierra so after downloading it let's open vmware workstation player so let's open it now try to create new virtual machine and click on have installed system letter and here you now see the option of apple mac os x here you can see several versions plus 10.12 will work for 10.12 as well as 10.13 so now give a name to the virtual machine so let's name mac os 10.13 hi sierra and uh, you have to select a location where you want to install so i am going to create a new folder on the desktop named mac os high sierra you can install anywhere as you want but for the simplicity i am going to install on the desktop now click on next and here you have to select the disk size you can select whatever you want i am going to select uh, 40 gb which is the default one and click on store virtual disk into a single file you can customize your hardware setting from here so let's change my memory setting from 2 gb to 4 gb leave the number of processor as it is you can check here virtualization but uh, leave it as automatic because it will choose automatically whatever when needed now leave all setting as it is and click on close and click on finish now you can see a folder macOS high sierra on the desktop in which we have installed our macOS and you will see some files in it now let's edit a virtual machine and here you have to delete hard disk so remove hard disk and create a new one you have to click on add and then click on hard disk and click on next file seta is recommended and then use our existing virtual disk now here you have to select the mac os image file which we have downloaded at first so i am going to select mine so let's select mac os high sierra vmdk virtual image file so select and click on ok it was that file which is on my folder right now which we have extracted from the six parts and then extract it to a single one so now go to the mac os high sierra installation folder and edit mac os high sierra configuration file you will see here vmware virtual machine configuration file and edit with notepad now you have to add a single line here smc dot version equal double quote zero double quote int now save it now we are ready to run our operating system in virtual machine so play in virtual machine
by selecting the operating system which we have installed here you can see the macOS logo it will take some time here you can see in my case it is not showing the home screen welcome logo but uh, in your case you will see that logo because I have already installed it previously a user is automatically found so it is not showing that logo but in your case you will see a welcome logo where you have to select your country and then you have to select your language and then you have to select whether you want to transfer information from other Mac to this Mac or not so click on don't transfer any information which is the last option and then click on continue now you will see a option to sign in your Apple ID you can also create but uh, whether if you have already a Apple ID then you can enter that ID or you can create later so you can also skip that step and now you have to create a computer account where you have to enter your full name account name password or password hint so enter that and then continue now here you can see my macOS version is 10.13.2 macOS i Sierra now you have to do some tweaks here because you may have problem during, during full screen so you have to do this tweak so go to player and click on remove all devices and then click on CD DVD SATA and here you have to use ISO file which is in the patch folder and select uh, VM tool click on open and then click on ok so now it's done and you will see a uh, VMware tools icon on your home screen so now let's install it double click on it select continue continue install enter your password continue installation now within some time installation will be successful then just start so after installing vmware tools when you re restart your pc then you can see a pop-up appearing which says system extension block so for that you have to do this tweak go to system preferences and then go to security and privacy and here you will see allow apps downloaded from option click on allow and then you have to click on the lock in the general tab click the lock to make changes and then enter your password and then click on unlock then again you have to restart your virtual machine by turning off your Mac so after that you start your PC and you will see a full screen option will be enabled so that's it so we have successfully installed Mac OS high Sierra on our PC and I think you have also installed on yours so if you like my video then please hit like button and don't forget to share to others so that uh, others also get benefited and uh, if you have any suggestions or if you have any query then comment down below in the comment box i will reply all your comments so thanks for watching goodbye